So here's my little electric truck that I made. And uh, I just added this battery. These are the four batteries, 12 volts each, equaling 48 volts. Um, but that one, it's got this bump in it and stuff. It's only, it's only holding uh, 10 volts. And um, I didn't have enough power to get up the hill with a load of wood in the, in the, in the bed here. <clears throat> so um, I threw this one in, I scabbed it into the system and now we got 62 volts. Can you see that? 62 volts. So I'm gonna give this thing a test drive right now and see what happens. Hopefully it works, otherwise I might have to replace the whole system. But let's see. All right, I am about ready to give this new battery in my system a try here. And I won't be surprised if something just pops and breaks. But here it goes, I'm putting my, whoop. It's put in reverse, it's starting to move. Hey, nothing's broken yet. The bolts are going down, that's normal. All right. Moving, moving, moving. Let's throw it forward. Oh, what happened? Uh-oh, what's happening? Something, something is not working. Probably some kind of overload in the motor controller. All right, I'm gonna turn the camera off so I can fool with this. So the conclusion is, is that it will not take the extra voltage with tying another battery in series. Um, here I can actually show you, and if I put this in reverse, it will go all right. But in forward, it cuts out like that. Huh. 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 And the best that I can figure is that the motor controller has a um, high and low voltage because it acts just like it does when the voltage is low on the batteries and the saying, charge me up, so it gives you huh. So, um, actually it's a little bit worse. So, um, I replaced the 10 volt battery with this and ran it at the 48, which charges go about 54 volts. But the whole unit still was a little low on power for getting up the hills. And I need it to work better than that. So I decided to go with a 72 volt, 3000 watt system. I'm gonna be upgrading the current system with. New batteries, new motor controller, new motor. I'm gonna be putting that in and I'm gonna be doing some other modifications to this uh, little unit. So stay tuned and take care.